everyone, it's Mara Allied of Wind, Water and Wisdom and I was just on a flight the other day from California back to the Northeast after visiting my son and we have what we all fear, a, pa a passenger that is just not going to be great to sit next to. So I'm traveling as inexpensively as I can, I'm in the back of the plane, I'm in the middle seat and I have this passenger next to me who is just not, unfortunately he was not mentally well. He was taking excessive pills. He was drinking um, excessively. It was very early in the morning. He was swearing. He was rambling. He was disgruntled. And we had to sit next to each other for six hours. At even one point, he was passed out so cold, he was just flopping onto me. So not ideal. Now, I had two essential oils with me. I had my own blend. I must have known intuitively I would need these. I had balance and protection. These are great oils to be working with when you are traveling. So I immediately took out my balance and I rolled it on the bottoms of my feet. I rolled it on my wrists and I inhaled. So you can inhale directly from the bottle. You can anoint your wrists. I put it on the bottom of my feet to get like a whole body and I put it on the back of my neck. That's going to bring my energy down. It's going to center me. It's going to ground me. It's going to make me feel a little less like Things are not in my control. Look, I, I'm going to feel more in control using balance. I'm bringing balance back into my emotions and not going into my head. Then I have protection. Now, how I use protection is I put the oil in my palm, I rub it together, and then, of course, I'm on the plane, so people might think I'm crazy, but I just actually just put it over me energetically as if to protect my energetic field. So if you don't feel comfortable doing that in public, you can inhale and you can anoint the wrists, back of your neck, your throat, your forehead, your feet. But I just love to just kind of go in the ladies room or men's room and just kind of put it over your energetic field all the way to your feet and just ask to be protected from any negative energy that people around you may be carrying or residual energy that's around that is not in your highest and best. So. That's how I survived my flight. They help tremendously. They're available at my shop. If you have other oils, the oils I would use if you have on hand, Myrtle, which is in my protection, is a protection oil. That's an oil that I use all the time for protection. So you could use Myrtle if you have it. And then if you were looking for that grounding, Vetiver would be a good one if you had that on hand. Or the Shinrin Yoku, um, the forest bathing one. Those are my two faves for bringing my energy down, centering me, and making me feel less in my head, more in my body. So, if you're flying anytime soon, I highly recommend having some oils around you that can balance and ground and protect.